there are different types of diabetes and uh, type 1 diabetes occurs in young females type 2 also can occur at younger and younger age and in the reproductive age group the uh, age group between adolescence and uh, before the family is completed that is a time when uh, diabetes can result in lots of menstrual irregularities so adolescent uh, girls uh, can uh, develop uh, uh, menstrual irregularities and on the other hand menstrual irregularities can ultimately result in diabetes so this condition called polycystic ovary syndrome can uh, ultimately lead to diabetes because the mechanism of both is similar both are due to insulin resistance uh, in uh, married females who already have diabetes uh, there may be initially some difficulty in conception, there is definitely some effect on sexual health because of uh, some vaginal infections or in general because of ne uh, neuropathic abnormalities. So th that is one part of it. Again because if they may not be ovulating properly, so th there may be a delay in conceiving. During pregnancy there is increased chance of high blood pressure, preeclampsia. Uh, premature deliveries, even abortions in patients with diabetes. Plus, uh, all the complications of diabetes, if they are present in pre-pregnancy period, all of these can progress during pregnancy. So, uh, diabetes has to be taken care of, a good pre-pregnancy counselling in females and a good uh, counselling about reproductive health in girls with diabetes is really important in females at this stage. After menopause, uh, it does not directly affect uh, reproductive health but the chances of increased uh, cardiovascular disease is something to focus on. So that is how different stages of uh, women can be affected by diabetes.